am the greatest. Come on, look power. Come on, look power. Come on, look there. Come on, look, come on, look. Come on, look, come on, look. YouTube. Uh, I just want to have heart to heart to start off this vlog. Um, so I've had a, like a really bad couple days, like for different reasons, and I'm just getting sick and tired of it. And the heaviest reason is being home and not doing anything not having an internship and being broke not getting a job because I can't get one while I'm here I tried it just it never worked out um I'm just I'm really tired of being here um Memphis Tennessee is my home I love it it'll always be my home I just, I don't like being here for longer than a couple weeks. I've been here since June 6th. It is now June 16th, I believe, because it's about 12 a.m. or 1 a.m., so it's the 16th officially. I'm honestly just tired of being here, um, not doing anything. I constantly feel unsafe riding around my city. I've been shot at couple times um just being at the wrong place at the wrong time uh had to deal with the dysfunctional family issues and you know i just i don't like being here i like being at school being productive getting my education getting my degree being with my friends i don't have, I don't have too much of that here um you know i read books i write a little bit and I try to be, you know, as productive as I can. But being in Memphis is just not my cup of tea, you know. I think I'm going to do like a full video on this. Because it's really hard being somebody from Memphis, Tennessee. Moving and then coming back. And then like, and not being the same pace. Not doing the same things. Not feeling like you're living up to your potential. I feel really stagnant. And I get really, really sad. Um... Because I don't like sitting still. I don't like being stagnant. I like doing things. And I feel like I can't do that while I'm just in Memphis. Sitting here. Not at school. Um, so I'm going to work on not coming back. Next summer. Having an internship. Like I'll visit of course. Because it's where my family is. But I just cannot be here longer than a couple weeks at the most. Um. I have to be here till August 23rd. It kills me to say that because it's July. And I have like a little over a month left and I'm just, I'm exhausted. Like my patience has worn down. I just, I can't, I can't do this anymore. I really can't. So... Honestly, I just I just wanted to tell you guys that because I know I like seem really happy in my vlogs. I do because genuinely I can keep myself happy. But at these bad couple of days, everything has just been falling down on me. And I just I wanted to let you guys know like this is how I really feel about being home. Like sometimes I can be really, really happy. Um, but I can be really, really sad too, cause I'm a human being and I just want, I, I want to be completely honest in my vlogs. I want to show you guys, sorry, what I go through because that's what I do this for and I wouldn't be real if I didn't show y'all. So I just wanted to start this video off with a heart to heart about how I really feel about being at home for a long extended period of time, not doing anything. Um. But yeah, uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna turn the camera off now so I can stop making you guys sad. But uh, 
I'll check you guys tomorrow. I have to go to church in the morning. So, I'll see you guys tomorrow or later in the day. Right. Good morning. Um, This morning I'm at church. Purely because I have to go. Not because um, of my own free will. Um, still not having a good day. I couldn't sleep. I also freaking spilled Diet Coke on my computer on accident trying to prevent it from happening but I made it happen so I'm just not having a good couple days at all hopefully it'll get fixed or I'll just buy a whole new computer honestly I just think I needed a whole new computer anyway um but Alright, well, I'm gonna go into church and sit in the back and eat my McDonald's and be left alone because I don't want to be here. Like, I literally told my mom, like, I'm not a Christian. And she was like, well, do you believe in anything? What kind of question is that? But okay, like, yeah, I do believe in a higher power. It just ain't God from the white man, you know what I mean? Sorry for the people who are watching this who are Christian or any other religion because I just don't deal with organized religion right now or probably ever. But yeah. I'll see y'all. Hey so, I broke my computer last night. I'm gonna have to get a new one. I'm gonna get the MacBook Pro, maybe in a couple weeks. But I was here and I've seen the mirrorless cameras that I've been looking for. And price is still expensive. Oh, whatever. How you do? <laughs> now you wanna be in it? Now you wanna be in it? What's up, y'all? What's up? Okay. So, we are about to go to the movies. We actually just finished vacuuming in my car. It's really hot outside. But we're finna go see The Purge. Yes, me and my bestie finna go see The Purge. You, you know, know, we late on seeing it. We are very late on seeing The Purge. Hey, better we're, late than never. Better late than never, right? <laughs> but yeah, so we're finna head there. We're actually gonna go to Applebee's first, which I'm really excited about because I freaking love Applebee's. Because <laughs> they got the onion rings. And the two for 20. You said onion rings. Hmm? Onion rings. You like onion rings? He like onion rings. I was really finna hit you if you didn't like onion rings. I was gonna hit you because you don't like Zaxby's. <laughs> because anytime I go to Zaxby's, I feel like I gotta get a salad with the chicken. I don't like they like chicken sandwiches or, or whatever. Chicken. I'd rather go to Chick-fil-A. But I have to, I have to boycott oh, Chick-fil-A. So I ain't had Chick Fil A in a minute, actually, but I'm boy, I'm boycotting Chick Fil A for their homophobia and stuff like that. So we're gonna uh, have bears and see the purge. I'm so excited. My best friend been neglecting me. It's okay. He been in classes. He been working. I ain't even gonna hold it against him. He been doing what he got to do. You know, making this money, getting his education. I'm so proud been of you. Trying. So proud of you, best friend. All right, y'all. Now I'll talk to you. Wait, the lighting. I'll talk to y'all later. Hey y'all, so I'm at my grandma's house right now and I was getting my car fixed and guess what y'all got air now? I don't, so I've been chilling here with grandma and my niece who's over here. Say hi niece. It's hi my niece. It's my niece Alicia. So I've been here for uh, since what like nine, nine-ish this morning yeah. and so I've just been chilling here because I have to pick up one of my uh, peoples from camp today. So we went to Wendy's. I just want y'all to understand why people can be privileged as I don't know. I'll get out. I'm looking at the drink selection, okay? It's one of those drinks, drink machines that you have to like push the button to uh, get the get the drink you want. I'm looking at the dress. She was like, she came up beside me. Can I get some ice? Can I get a drink first? <laughs> <laughs> like, there's a line. It's me and my 
my knees. Can I get a drink? Can I? Just get your privilege white ass on <laughs> out of here. Like, I was, she didn't get your man, I wanted to smack her so bad, but I was, I was being polite. I was in the middle of Wendy's and I'm in Arkansas. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no, no. <laughs> so, I was like, yeah, sure. So, I'm just continuing to like find the water. But y'all, when I tell you, it was so hard for me to like keep calm at that moment with everything. I, w I was like, yeah, I wanted to be like, yeah, sure, Black Lives Matter. <laughs> <laughs> Privileged white Americans, this is a message to you. When I'm getting a drink first, wait. Wait in line like everybody else. Just wait in line. Wait in line. That's all I'm asking you to do is just to wait in line like we all do. We all got to wait in line. We got to wait in line at the doctor's office, at the grocery store. Just because I ain't pressing the button to get a drink yet don't mean you you can just step in front of me and get some ice. I don't care. But yeah, that's all I wanted to say. That this white lady wanted to like step in front of me and ask because she gets some ice when I'm really just trying to get a drink. Like You can wait like five seconds. You really can. But I'll see y'all later. When I go back home, I'm probably going to undo these twists today, even though I'm probably not going to go anywhere. I'm probably going to do it on camera so y'all can see what my hair looks like, do my, do me a little hair tutorial. But yeah. So I'm going to talk to y'all later. Bye bye. My ass Thanks, Alicia, for that tidbit. Getting a new MacBook. Um, happy and sad at the same time, I can say. But I am. Yeah, hey y'all, so I just left Best Buy and I was dreading going and getting my computer um, because of the amount that it costs to, you know, get the computer. But when I went in there, they were like, hey, so yeah, MacBook Pro, close to like $2,000 with Apple Care, you know, covers everything for about like two years. Okay, cool. I'll be good till my senior year. Um, they were like, so yeah, you can, um, you can either pay for it all right now, which I was dreading. I was pulling out all of my cards. I was like, let me get my debit card, my two credit cards, Lord Jesus, help me. And she was like, oh, you can also monthly finance it with per getting a, um, Best Buy credit card. I was like, oh, really? I thought about it. I was like, you know, Jamila, you are in Best Buy like every couple months. You get your phones from Best Buy. You take care of your computer at Best Buy. Like, you never step into an Apple store because their prices are ridiculous due to commission. So I was like, okay, Jamila, go ahead and get the credit card. You're an adult. You can pay for it monthly and you don't have to put up a two thousand dollars right now why not so i did and i'm very very happy with it 12 months um financing no interest i could do that i could really really do that you know i'm excited like it's a burden off of my heart because credit you know I'm t I don't like debt but i also don't like spending my money like my real money that i already have that's in my bank account. I don't like spending it. Um, so, I like monthly payments. I really do. So, I did that. $150 a month. $152 a month. Really not that bad. Um, and when I have my job, when I go back, I won't have a problem. So, I think I'm good. I'm Gucci. I'm Gucci. Um... But yeah, I'm about to go home, eat, and set up my computer and make sure I don't do anything to it. I've set up new rules. No more drinks on the table next to my computer. All drinks go on the floor all the time. No drinks on the on the table next to my computer. Because that's how it happened, y'all. I had my drink next to my computer i was like oh this is wet i don't want this next to my computer dripping all on the keyboard pick it up my clumsy stupid self drop the whole cup on the computer and my warranty was only one year on that computer and it was over 
now I have a two year warranty with Apple Care that covers spills, covers screens, cover damages. So I think I made a good decision today and I already wanted a MacBook Pro anyway, you know, with more storage and eight, gig, eight gigs of like memory so I can like swap between. Uh, I, I can keep multitasking like I want to multitask because my computer likes to crash um, because it don't have enough memory uh, RAM as they say but yeah I'm gonna go home I'm probably gonna film um, a hair tutorial how to do how I do untwist my hair um, I don't know why I decided to do it tonight because it's nighttime I might end up doing it tomorrow morning when I wake up because honestly it's a bad idea to like take your hair out and then not going out what you gonna do tonight nothing so I just might do it in the morning when I come back so yeah all right y'all well I'm gonna go home I'll see y'all later tonight maybe if I'm doing something that I want to show y'all so peace out all right y'all I'm about to open my MacBook I'm so excited because I got the Pro, Pro. <coughs> excuse me because last time I had the Air and I'm gonna come I'm gonna show y'all the comparison between the two in size because like that was so small like the screen was so small i'd be like squinting at it but like yeah now i got the pro 13.3 inch oh, yeah. and this is what it looks like in the package thank you best buy thank you so i guess i'm trying to get it out now Okay, this is a struggle to do on one hand and acrylic nail, so just bear with me, y'all. So this is it. This is the thing. That is cool. But yeah, this is the pro, 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 pro. Good morning. I am up at like seven in the morning every morning. Because I get to drop off somebody at, um, at their camp for a little bit of cash. But, you know, a little price to pay just to get a little money. But um, I just want to say good morning. Um, I'm getting a little better at waking up anyway. Because I do have to get up early during the year. So why not start now? But yeah, I just want to say good morning. And I'll see you guys later. Hey y'all. Um, so it's like 1.13. And I've been asleep since I got back. I'm going to tell y'all why. It's fucking raining. It's raining. And that's exactly why I've been asleep. Every time it rains, it knocks me out. Like, literally, I've been asleep all day. Like, since I got back, like, around 9.50 something, I went back to sleep. And I've been hungry. You know, I'm like, oh, wow, I haven't eaten all day. And I'm like, why haven't I eaten? Because I've been asleep. This is getting ridiculous. Um, I really have to get up and cook me something to eat. Because honestly, this is not good. This, not eating is not good. I literally got up, had an Eddie Buddy bar and some like goldfish and went back to sleep. But yeah, now I'm watching um, East Los High. Like I watched. <laughs> it's like a Hulu original. Like I watched it um, a while back and then I just put out a new season. So I'm watching it now. He was arrested for drug trafficking. Okay, so so you made some mistake. We all have. I mean, haven't you? Sure. Back in the day. I'm talking about now. About to marry my mom. Hey, don't say that. I love your mom. And I love Jesus. But he'll never make it if someone doesn't give him a chance. Hey y'all, so I just got done taking out my hair and yes, it's gonna look like this for a minute. Um, I just untwisted them. I haven't like undid a lot of the twist, like the, the little twist that came out of the twist. And then I'll just do that in a couple days to make it get older and it'll be bigger. So wait on it. <laughs> hey y'all, I just got through un raveling all my twists and like sort of throwing it out i guess you can say but yeah so much hair <laughs> so much hair <laughs> yeah i've come along
long way though. Yeah. What's up, y'all? Uh, me and my mom are about to go to Akita again. Uh, I just want to show you guys my outfit. Just like really something simple, like a little my go-to green crop top and my skirt. It's just really nice for just throwing on and going somewhere. You know, so yeah. What's up, y'all? It's Wednesday. Yes, almost done with the week, y'all. Um, it is like. 7 40 something and i'm you know picking up the boy to take him to camp having a good morning my hair is out i'm feeling nice um you know today is probably gonna be a real cool day probably hanging out with kendall um just chilling doing some stuff for um uh, my positions at wellesley um you know just you know normal shit i mean stuff my bad i'm trying to like lessen the cursing on my vlogs and in my personal life but uh we're gonna see how that works out um let me turn this radio down because if it started talking but yeah y'all um i just want to give a holla you know what i'm saying um yesterday i didn't really do too much except for go and get food with my mom for a minute and i had like a two-hour meeting um with one of the positions that i'm doing so it was cool um my head hurt after that which i think everybody did who did a lot of planning a lot of talking but yeah so i just wanted to give y'all a holla before i like go on with the rest of my day um and go grab kindle and all that stuff so i will see y'all on the flip side